like with me Aura Fadila, we provide you an updated news all around the world. For the main news of today is the impact of economic crisis on education. The year 2020 is a worrying year for all countries, including Indonesia. This is due to the emergence of COVID-19 outbreak organizing from the China city of Wuhan and spreading throughout the world in early 2020. The search of transmission of this virus case is not yet known for sure, but the first case was associated with a fish market in Wuhan, China. December 18 to December 29, 2019, infected with COVID-19 from December 39, 2019 to January 3, 2020, this case increasing rapidly, marked by an increase to 44 cases, Less than a month, this virus has spread to other provinces in China, Thailand, Japan, and South Korea. According to Chuan Ning in 2020, social activities were prohibited and temporarily suspended. The economic weakness, transportation services were reduced and regulated very tightly. Tourism was closed, shopping centers were empty of visitors, and even closed. The informal sector, as Online motorcycle taxis, alcohol drivers, mobile traders have experienced a very drastic decrease of income. They may even go out of business or close their business, and those who work with people are laid off and sudden are sent home. The national examination was not held. Almost all country in the Asia Pacific region, especially Indonesia, are facing serious problems in the field of education because of economic crisis that is befalling various countries. The Ministry of Education and Culture issued a policy for community to carry out learning and teaching activities from home. Therefore, online learning was chosen as a solution to the learning model carried out during the COVID-19 pandemic. Globally, based on UNESCO data on March 19, 2020, 112 countries have implemented learning from home, including Malaysia, Thailand, Germany, Austria, Mexico, South Africa, Yemen, and Zambia. Of the 112 countries, 101 countries implement learning from home police nationally. Meanwhile, 11 other countries, including Indonesia, implement home learning is curtain areas. Do the police that have been in effect of for almost two years, finally, many students, including university students, complain that this online method is not as effective as learning in person and begin to wonder when it will be allowed to go to school as usual because the use of technology is not a problem. There are many variants of problems that hinder the implementation of the effectiveness of online learning methods such as limited mastery of information technology by teachers and students, inadequate facilities and infrastructure, limited internet access, and the appropriate budget provisions. So that's all for today. Thank you for your attention. I'm Aura. Have a nice day.